Guys, this is the last time we're going to see the Tenar. It's getting sold now. So guys, the time's around 1:52. I have to go to the HSR BDA complex at two. I won't be there in eight minutes because I'm around. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how far I am, bro. I think I'm around 11 or 12 kilometers. I just got stopped by cops. Uh, so that was a big delay. So the documents of this bike is locked in the RTO. And like to transfer the name, it was so difficult for us because uh, my friend who bought this, he stays in Karnataka. His permanent address is Karnataka. And also, but this is a TN registered bike, so getting the name transfer done and the NOC and all it was like a really hectic thing. And then because of COVID, it got delayed. That's why we still haven't got it. And it's so hard to explain to the cops, bro. The cops think I'm riding some illegal bike. Okay, someone's calling. Hello, bro. I just got caught by cops. Stop me. Asked. Uh, show me DL uh, insurance and RC. I showed him DL. Then I told him about RC scene. Bro, his face expressions only changed. Bro, he thought I'm. He thought he got some. It's a big day for him because he is going to arrest me. Grey bike. Bro, he said grey bike. Bro, he's saying it's grey. He is very convinced it's grey. Like it took me so long to explain. You know what the scene is. Yeah. So this is the last last time, guys. We're going to see this, and I think it's going to be a couple of years before I can afford a later class. And uh, maybe you know if I sell the MT, actually, to be honest, I can, I can, I can try to get it right now. But um, but it won't be. It's not the right time. Like the MT needs to get repaired. I need to spend some time with the MT, and then maybe a liter class. And I don't think I want to get a liter class at the cost of the MT because I can buy a liter class any time. All these ten Rs, very common, bro. You can buy them, but MTs won't come again. Like if I sell it for seven lakhs or six lakhs or ten lakhs or whatever amount I sell it right now, I'll not find it for that price again for a long time. Forget the price. I won't find it itself, bro. Like I've been checking the market. Uh, there was an MT OD registered one for sale, twenty eighteen model. And the facelift and all the evil eyes, which you guys keep telling me to get done for my MT, that has it. Uh, yeah, that that was the one that got sold, like I think two months ago. And since then, there's not been a single O9 on sale that has come under my radar, because I have a lot of friends who have asked me, bro, I need to buy, I need to buy. But in that, only few friends are actually like willing to buy and want to buy and capable of buying. So for them, I am searching. Thank you, bro. You want me to rev? You want me to rev? Oh, look, that's an ether, bro. My fucking ether hasn't come, bro. Like I booked in November, it's Feb, bro, and they still haven't even like given me the bike. Nothing, bro. Like I know there is a semiconductor issue, but why are you still taking bookings, bro? If your back order is, when I ask them, you know, they're like, they're, we are back ordered till October. We're first clearing, oct I mean, not back ordered. They have to still fulfill October order. See, these on this on the ether showroom I booked. Like bro, like you should guys should stop taking bookings, bro. Seriously, it just you just never going to deliver on time. At least take bookings that you can, that you know that your supply chain can afford to fulfill. Oh no! Let's go. We can fuel up ahead. Oh, ahead, I don't know where we can get 100 octane. Looks like we'll have to settle with Shell. I know uh, for this bro at least 95 octane bro at least and the shell doesn't uh, provide all of that just fueled up guys thing is uh, there's no fuel meter so we have to pay attention to how much we fill here only i got caught once bro for empty empty is exhaust stupid manoj bro I told him, you know, let's put the DB killer. He's like, no, he'll ride without it. He rode without it. And I told him, okay, at least upshift and ride. He didn't do that. And you know, when I told him, cops will be in front here, exactly in this turn. I told him, bro, cops will be ahead. Ride peacefully. Stay on the right side. Cops were there. They saw him from a mile away. They ran into the road. 
I passed by because I was on a scooter. On one of the scooter, they stopped him. <sighs> Forget the fine amount, bro. That you know how it works here. But my main headache was we lost so much time there, bro. So, are you guys gonna miss this bike? I will, bro. Like my liter class experience. I I'm so grateful. At, at 2022, I was riding a liter class in Bangalore, the city where I was born and brought up, where I. Was riding an 18-year-old scooter, uh, Bullet, Pulsar, MT-09, C9, and Red ZX10. Bro, all these bikes I've ridden, bro. I know it. Uh, a lot of people might have ridden H2 and uh, ZX10, RR, Brutale, RR. All these rare, expensive bikes as well. But this is something I always dreamt of, bro. Like when I'm working, when I'm in the when I'm in the office or. When I was in college, like I always used to dream, like bro, one day I should take a 10R or take an S1000 R and ride it in the streets. Man, I'm so upset. But you know, this bike is going to a new owner, new person to a new person is going to care for this bike. This bike needs a lot of care. So it's a 10R, bro. What's up? What's up, bro? Nice bike, bro. Thank you, bro. Uh, you want to spin on it? No, no, not right now. Okay, okay, bro. Bro, please, da, take this bike and go. My back is dying. You know, when I sit on my chair in the dining table, my back is hurting. When I lie down for to sleep, my back is hurting. That's why you should not ride this in the city. And in my vlog, you know what I said? I said. Uh, most it, bike. It's not. I didn't say that. I said it doesn't matter if you have lower back issues or your vertebrae breaks, because you look sexy on the bike. That's all matters. <laughs> and bro, I feel it so badly now. So guys, this is the last time you'll we'll see the 10 R's. New buyers are here. So there you go. They are here to take the 10 R home. I think that's it for this vlog. Yeah, I want to miss the 10 R. I'm bikeless as of now. I just have the Enfield. Now my priority is fixing the. Empty quickly, so let's see. That's the next agenda. Bro, see, perfect, huh? Setup. Mm. Screen is there. Mic is here. So, how are you feeling, bro? Gaur? Tattoos there. Okay, okay. Ah. Everyone comment tattoo. Bro, you know if I tell people to comment, they actually do it, bro. You are fan base. Yeah. I did you see my yesterday's work? Vivek. Yeah. Vivek reaction op. Did you see in the comments? <laughs> Same today. Gaur, Gaur tattoo op. So anyway, how are you feeling, bro? That your tenar is sold now. Very bad. And good. <laughs> because money came, it's money good. Is coming, but asset is good. Yeah. Appreciating asset. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, definitely consider liking, subscribing, sharing, and uh, say goodbye. Direction are in the comments, and I'll see you guys in another one.